Hello, welcome to GTEC Studios. In this tutorial, I will show you how to troubleshoot common errors of Apache. By following this video, you can save your time to identify the root cause of the error. So let's get started. So these are the most commonly used commands to troubleshoot Apache across different Linux distribution like system CTL, general CTL and Apache CTL. And you can refer logs in the Linux system to identify the root cause. Now I'll show you how to use each command for the troubleshooting. So first of all we will start with system CTL. I have made some changes in the config file of Apache so that I can highlight the error. So as you can see that syntax is system CTL status Apache 2. So this is your first step for troubleshooting of Apache. So first of all we need to check whether service is running or not. So here service is not running due to some syntax error. Next command you can use general CTL. So in this command we are looking for Apache 2 service specific events of today's date. So in the output you can see there is syntax error as displayed in the previous command. So apache ctl config test. Let's say you have made some changes in the configuration file. After making the changes you can check the syntax. In the initial step if there is an error you can identify them. These three commands or utilities are showing there is some syntax related problem. But let's say if you are facing non syntax related issues then you can refer logs. So default log directory of apache in ubuntu is var log apache2. In this apache2 folder you will get two files one for the access log and one for the error log. When, when someone trying to access your server then you will get access log into access file and if there is an error then you will get those log into error file yeah generally i use these four methods to troubleshoot apache related errors in ubuntu or rhl thanks for watching